How do I calculate the required lumber size for a 20-foot span? Hello there! In this video, we're going to break down the process of how to calculate the required lumber size for a 20-foot span. This is critical information if you're building a structure such as a deck, a roof, or a floor system. Understanding the load capacity of different sizes of lumber over specific spans helps ensure your structure is safe and stable. What is a span? Before we get into the calculations, let's clarify what we mean by span. The span is the distance between two intermediate supports for a structure. For instance, in a deck, the span would be the distance between the deck piers or posts. The span plays a crucial role in determining the load a particular lumber size can handle. What factors influence lumber size calculation? Several factors influence the lumber size for a span. The type of load. This could be a live load, temporary loads that can move and change like people or furniture, or a dead load, permanent, fixed weight like the structure itself. The species and grade of the wood. Different types of wood have different strengths. Also, within a species, different grades can handle different loads. The span length. A longer span means the lumber must support more weight over a greater distance, which requires a larger size or higher grade of lumber. How to calculate the lumber size. Now, on to the calculation part. Unfortunately, there is not a straightforward calculation for determining the size of lumber for a particular span because of the aforementioned factors. However, span tables exist that provide this information. Here's a simplified process. 1. Identify the type of load, the species and grade of the wood, and the span length. These will be your key parameters. 2. Consult the appropriate span table. Span tables for different species and grades of lumber can be found in various building and construction reference books or online resources. These tables will list the maximum spans for different sizes of lumber. 3. Find your parameters in the table and identify the required lumber size. In these tables, you'll find the appropriate lumber size for your specific span and load requirements. An example. For instance, if you're building a deck with Southern Pine, number 2 grade, for a live load of 40 pounds per square foot and a dead load of 10 pounds per square foot, your span table might indicate that a 2 by 8 board on 16 inch centers will suffice. And there you have it. That's a general overview of how you can calculate the required lumber size for a 20 foot span. Remember, always consult the correct span tables for your specific circumstances, and if you're unsure, don't hesitate to seek professional advice. Safety is paramount when it comes to structural building. Hope this video has been helpful. Happy building!